So, Nancy Pelosi is going ahead with the 1-6 committee. It was a shocking day in American history, and we need answers no matter how much the Republicans don't want them answered. Pelosi has a quorum, meaning the majority of the members of the committee to move forward, and bipartisanship with the inclusion of the Republicans Liz Cheney and Adam Kinzinger. Hillary Clinton testified for 11 straight hours on Benghazi. The American people deserve to see Lauren Boebert answer for why she was giving tours to insurrectionists or texting them Pelosi's location. We need to know why Marjorie Taylor Greene was taking meetings with them and telling us it was 1776. We need to speak to Roger Stone and Josh Hawley and Ted Cruz. We need to know what McCarthy himself said to the president during the invasion, or why a Supreme Court justice's wife was renting buses for the insurrectionists. We should hear from the head of the Proud Boys and the Three Percenters. We need to ask the National Guard where they were and why they didn't come. We need to know why the FBI didn't see it coming when those of us at home totally did. We should hear testimony from the heads of the Pentagon about where the military was and what they were asked to do or not to do. We need to know what Capitol Police officers were told and why they weren't properly armed. And finally, many of us would like to hear from Donald Trump. He needs to speak to the fact that his love fest was so violent and what the plan really was and what the party in the tent was watching for and why he didn't call for backup. Now, most of us paying attention know what the plan was, but it needs to be laid out and it needs to be seen for all its ugliness. The fact that it failed doesn't mean it didn't happen. And it doesn't matter how much the Republicans try and muddy the water, the truth will come out. Count on it.